the institution I head, is dedicated to transforming all farmers in the state to natural farming. We started the program in 2016 with about 40,000 farmers in 700 villages. The number of farmers this year uh, has been uh, 630,000 farmers. They're not using any synthetic chemicals, fertilizers, pesticides, herbicides. The collaboration of, with CIRAD is a very interesting aspect of our work. So the idea was how do we take this to policy makers as to what will happen in the state if we adopt natural farming at scale or if we continue with conventional agriculture, and what will happen to employment, happen to economy, happen to poverty eradication, and what are the costs or what are the penalties of not transforming? It's very difficult to, to change uh, behavior of farmers who for the last 50, 60 years have been told that if you don't use chemicals, the crops will not grow. To me, the role of uh, women collectives is the most important factor. In rural Andhra Pradesh, 8.3 million women are organized into self-help groups. So once they made this as their agenda, then it became easy. The support of the government in terms of uh, creating a separate department for natural farming and providing the financial resources for the transformation. We developed material for farmers in very farmer-friendly language. It's knowledge-intensive agriculture. You have to reflect on what is happening in your field. It's not mindlessly going and buying some chemicals and dumping it in the soil. Best practicing farmer takes this knowledge to another farmer. They have done it in their field. They have tasted the success. They have learned many of these practices and they are taking this knowledge to their fellow farmers. We have been doing research on various aspects connected to natural farming because there were many critics. We have to sort of prove that this works. We realize that many people have to come together to make this a success. So we have collaborations with different uh, governments, philanthropies, research institutions. We are learning from them, they are learning from us. So it's creating a, a very healthy ecosystem. I see that uh, given the interest that so many countries in Africa, South America have in the success of the natural farming work in Andhra Pradesh, I have no doubt that uh, other countries also will feel the need for this kind of a visioning.